Hi everyone, Cayman Reynolds here and got my brother-in-law and my wife back in there in that shed. Everything's a, kind of a mess, but we're building a few hundred pallets and got a really cheap, oh, yeah, it's just not a bad extractor. We're fixing to sell it. Got a really good deal on it. Just kind of turning it around, sell it to somebody else, make a little money off of it. A lot of people get into bees, a lot of people get out. Got Joshua over here cutting up some two by fours and everything's fresh treated. That's my wife over there. Just kind of part of the process. We're getting ready for spring and all that. A little man lake extractor right there. I don't like the plastic on the inside. You know, it's, it's good hobby aside, size extractor, I'm sure. It'll be all right. We, uh, it, this is right now in the middle of the polar vortex or whatever special name those people have for it. It's cold. You know, back in the day, the people just said it was cold outside. It's freezing outside. And uh, I think it's beautiful. The sun's out. Yeah, it's cold, but it ain't going to stop us from doing some work. This is the time of year. All that equipment, those boards you see in the background, we've got to get those turn into boxes and you know we got to get all that work done here and get it done well before spring starts because I mean it's yeah I think it's the first day of February so it's going to be here before you know it this uh this maple tree is starting to really put on some yeah, you can probably see it in the video it's starting to put some little buds out and I promise you within the next couple of weeks that thing's going to be starting to produce some pollen got all those over there and uh, those uh, oak trees we got those there and we got those way down there I mean the bees and we got hickory trees they're going to be in these maples here in the next couple of weeks and then of course in the months of fall they're going to be oak and hickory pollens and it's, it's just going to be here before you know it so we're just prepping just this is Part of the stuff that we love, though, I thought I'd just share it a little bit with you. Oh, oh, I gotta show you this. All right. What a mess we got here. Firewood, anybody? All right. Girl power. All right, it is like 20-something degrees. Look at that cluster. Ooh, smells good. honey in there and look you got all this extra space up top yeah we're, it's not the ideal way people do most things and you know we don't have the insulated stuff and we don't have quilt boxes or anything like that but that's a big healthy cluster with a lot of young bees they're going to be just fine that's that's the most important thing healthy bees going into winter with plenty of food stuff and just you know make sure that your hives aren't leaky you get the bees get rained on and you're good to go so Anyways, this video's gotten way too long. Thanks for watching.